Hey, what's going on, guys? Talk Norris City here, back for a little different preview video. It's podcast recording night, but we thought we'd get this preview done because we are so committed to the game. We love the game. Oh, we love the game. Uh, a big thank you to One Football for sponsoring these preview videos throughout the all of the months. They're great. Uh, let's check out One Football. One moment. Chris, you've just downloaded it on your phone. One moment. A big thank you also to Prejudition for supplying the food to TNC. Yeah. Who, of course, is a sponsor of the channel. And you actually eat that every night. Good stuff. Mm. Uh, Chris has just downloaded one football on his phone. First of all, Norwich City to beat Forest. 43% of people predicted a Norwich City win. But really? the bigger percentage, 44% of people think Nottingham Forest are going to win. 13% of people going mm. for the draw. That is uh, out of 259 people who have predicted it. Let's have a look at the league table, how we fare after the weekend. And it's very close, us and Nottingham Forest there in 11th. We're up in 12th. Somehow we moved up the table from the weekend. Um, Did we? Yeah, we moved from 13th to 12th. To be fair, that draw wasn't the end of the world, Jack. It wasn't the end it of the world. Like it seemed like it at the time. <laughs> uh, I think have, you seen my, have you seen my post-match interview? It seemed like it at the time. Have you calmed down? A little bit. Okay. Uh, anyway, they've scored 25 goals this season. That's nine more than us. However, really? they've conceded 27. Mm. Very open, it seems. Uh, let's have a look at their recent form then. Um, a 1-0 defeat to Birmingham. I saw actually the guy next to me at the football. He had a seven-fold accumulator on, which was going to turn £500. It was only Nottingham Forest that let him down. He was fuming. Forest are Forest, aren't they? Forest are Forest. Birmingham, Birmingham. Birmingham, who are Birmingham, won 1-0 at the weekend. Mm. Before that, though, they had a crushing 4-0 win over QPR. Uh, before that, a... Smash phone Jonathan, screen, mate. Apple, if you want to sponsor a new phone screen, much appreciated. Uh, they lost 3-1 to Reading. They're in very indifferent form. They look a very indifferent team. Chris, we need to bounce back big time, don't we? Yeah, we do, Jack. And um, I think we can. I think we can. I think it completely changes the complexion of the confidence. I think you'll see the team go into it with a bit of a kind of... Fuck it attitude, to be honest with you. Mm. Um, if I'm allowed to say that, probably not. Never mind. Uh, there's um, the ad revenue gone. I'm not going to be earning any money this month. Don't worry, mate. That's that fine. Twice, That's mind. fine. But we are, because, you know, the, the, the pressure at home is clearly on. And I think that we're going to go there. We're going to try something different. We're going to have to try something different, Jack. And I think it will make for an exciting game. As you say, it could be quite open. Um, but without Brit Sumbalonga up top for Nottingham Forest, I, I can't see our, and, you know, even our, def our defence of late. I just... I still think we'll be fine. I mean, it seems like the defence is probably the thing we need to least worry about. Mm -hmm. It's it's the attacking... Well, I keep banging on about it, about that three or four, but in behind mm -hmm. the strikers. Surprisingly, really surprisingly, it's the midfield. Mm -hmm. um, apart from Madison, there are some big question marks over a lot of the players in there at the moment. Tom Tribal's out injured as well. This is what I mean, man. It's a big, big thing. But to be fair, you know... Um, is Tete back? No. Is Reed back? You read his fit, I think, yeah. Fine, Perfect. Harrison really. But that still does mean only really one... Let's not forget, we've got Louis Thompson. I was caught, To be honest with you, I was calling for Harrison Reid to come into the team over yeah. Tribal, regardless of Tom Tribal yeah. being injured. Uh, it, it's going to be a tough ask for any of them midfielders um, to, to operate as a, as a sole central defensive midfielder due to the injuries. But, positive, Pritchard's back for the under-23s. Oh, uh, not that that's going to affect this game in any shape or form. Oh, I can't wait um, it, let's get a quick score prediction. Um, I'm going to go for Desmond. Desmond too. Would you take that? Yeah, you probably. At the moment, yeah. yeah. I mean, look, I've said it from day one, Jack. If you can draw all of your home mm. games, you're in with a shout. But if you also draw all of your home games, <laughs> I know, Jack. But in yeah. our current form, yeah. away from home at Forest on Tuesday night, yeah, I would take a two-two draw. Yeah, I think that's a great shout actually, and I'm going to go for a two-two as well. Yeah. Uh, a big thank you to One Football. Links to them will be down in the description below. Chris has downloaded it and he's very picky with what he has on his phone. I am actually. So you download it too. If he likes it, you'll like it. I like it. You'll like it. Everyone likes it. Um, my dog probably even likes it. I reckon he does. Yeah, he loves it. Thanks very much for watching. See you soon. Won't see you at Nottingham. Not making the trip. Can't get the day off work. Sad. See you later.